And so it is quite possible to retrieve uh, notes for um, models and also drawings using NitroCell uh, and write directly to tables in Excel. Uh, to do that, we have to have a table set up to perform that write too. So I've got a, an example here of just a table we're going to create. Then I'm going to come in, I'm going to say, um, I'm going to use the table note function get. And this has several options. It's a very powerful functionality. So by default, it's going to take the active model. Um, you can also connect this with other tables and feed it with other tables to do almost like a for each if you wanted to. Um, but then you can also put in like the note name and also filter by note value if you wanted to. So if you add specific note wildcard matches as well as name or, or as well as value wildcard matches, you could actually do both of those with this function and then just write the results to the target table. So I'm just going to uh, write to um, the final table here. Got to spell it right though. And I'm just going to write everything that's in there. So what this has done is it's connected to the active model. And we should have four notes in our table, uh, which you can see here uh, we do. So uh, the table it's written is specific to uh, notes. So it tells us the item name, of course, the item root, uh, the note name, and then the current note value, and then the expanded note value. And then if there is, if it is a drawing and the notes are located on a drawing, it'll give you X, Y location of each of those notes on a drawing too. So um, the important thing to note here, <laughs> pun intended, is that the uh, expanded value will actually uh, show you what the current full text is, and the note value will show you uh, what the, um, uh, like if there's a PTC symbol in there, it'll show you that too. So if we go to uh, our end session here and, oh, let's open up uh, this, this uh, lower housing. Now I'm going to rerun this, and it's going to clear the table out and rewrite um, the data from the drawing here. And you'll see a good example of kind of what the node expanded looks like. So um, let's see here. Here it goes. So uh, if we take a look at this, you'll notice here that section uh, ampersand X section name is actually expanded out to this. So this is an example of an expanded note. And then you can see here that it's also brought, um, because we're dealing with a drawing, it's brought the notes, uh, the expanded values of the notes. If, if there are any symbol, um, symbols or parameter uh, references in here, it would expand those out uh, to kind of show what the uh, full text of that is. And then it's also showing the drawing location for where uh, the, these notes are actually located uh, on the drawing. So uh, Get Notes is, is a very, very powerful um, uh, capability. We'll do another video or two just to show you some additional bells and whistles.